I'm Natalia. You can find me on social media platforms as well, Fed Brain. Main focus of my online presence is to talk about nutritional neuroscience and mental health. Today, I would like to answer one of my followers' question, which is Can supplements like BCAAs make people more depressed? If you're interested in chemistry and human physiology, you will probably understand how valuable that question is. Let's start with the basic information. What is BCAAs? Branch chain amino acids are free amino acids that benefit muscle growth. Leucine, isoleucine and valine are taken by athletes whose aim is to build muscles in order to boost muscle growth and exercise performance. There is one relatively small amino acid which is believed to be involved in mood disorders. It's tryptophan. Depression is not all about serotonin, but an imbalance in serotonin levels can alter mood and lead to chronic depression. It is known that you can boost brain serotonin levels through tryptophan supplementation. Tryptophan depletion is seen in those with mood disorders, such as depression, but also brain serotonin levels drop when you follow a low tryptophan diet. Before tryptophan has an opportunity to influence serotoninergic activity in the central nervous system, it has to be transported across the blood-brain barrier. And now there is this problem. BCAS and tryptophan compete for the same receptor. Therefore, an excess of one can block the entry to the brain of the other. Ingestion of BCAS increases the concentration in the plasma. They will use the carrier system, not the tryptophan. This may reduce the reuptake of, of tryptophan uh, to the brain, by the brain. Some research shows that decrease in plasma tryptophan and tryptophan to BCAS ratio is present in depressed patients. To sum up this part of the video, we could say that when you decide to take BCAS supplement, you may be creating in your body imbalance, which can lead to bad mood because of the low serotonin levels in the brain. Unfortunately, answer to this question isn't that easy. There are also different studies which show that depressed patients have reduced activation of the mTOR pathway and the reduction of BCAS might contribute to that state. For sure, mTOR pathway is dysregulated during depressive symptoms and activating that pathway, for example by ketamine, can rapidly uh, decrease depressive symptoms in humans. That would suggest that there might be BCAA deficiency in depressed patients. The BCAS, uh, especially leucine, are significant activators of mTOR pathway and can boost the energy metabolism inside, inside the cells. In this case, it looks like BCAS could improve depressive symptoms. That's why I love biology. <laughs> it's also a mystery and one person has to find the best solution for themselves. I understand you. You want to build muscles and be happy at the same time. Here are a few of my ideas how you can use BCAS without worrying that it will negatively influence your mood. First of all, use BCAS to fuel your workout. Don't take them as a post-workout drink. Your muscles will use the BCAS during workout and there won't be many branch chain amino acids floating around your body, preventing tryptophan to cross the blood-brain barrier. Secondly, take your BCAS in the first part of the day. You need tryptophan also to produce melatonin and that hormone helps you to sleep better. That's why to patients with depression I recommend to consume carbohydrate-rich foods later in the day. That can indirectly boost the tryptophan uptake to the brain. Carb-rich meals evoke insulin response. High insulin signals to the cells and most importantly muscle cells um, show that they should take uh, amino acids like leucine uh, from the bloodstream. Therefore, 
that increases tryptophan to total amino acid ratio in our blood and tryptophan has higher chance to get to the brain and there evoke production of serotonin, serotonin and melatonin and your mood is enhanced. Third thing is that you can also supplement your diet with tryptophan in a pill form to balance your amino acids. And what is really the most important that you have to test how BCAS actually work for you. Write everything down, uh, have your mood tracker in hand, track how you feel when you take your supp supplements, etc. If you have any more questions uh, related to diet and mental health, please leave a comment down below. If you do not know uh, how to balance your diet to stabilize your mood, please connect with me on any social media platform. That's all for today. Wishing you a good day, keep your neurons wired and see you next time.